Hey guys, just want to address something quickly to this channel and to all the subscribers uh, of my channel. They know that I've been posting Master Lord content for quite a while now, and most of it's been uh, the following decks. I'd say Outer Chiefs, Thunder Dragons, and Generators. I'm trying out more decks um, at the moment, but there was one deck that's been my absolute favorite, which is Cyber Dragons. Quite a funny coincidence considering my name is Cyber God Gamer and I'm playing Cyber Dragons. But that's actually how I got my name in the first place. I, I, I thought I was a very good gamer. Uh, when I say very good gamer, I mean I was very skilled. So that's where God came from. I always played Cyber Dragons, so that's where you got the cyber from, and then I'm gaming, so that's where the game came from. But so, yeah, that's how the name was created. So all you guys, if you wanted to know. So, um, however, an issue came, which was uh, quite frequent, it was more than one person, and it happened on Master Door. So, I don't know if you guys know what Agnista is, uh, and what kind of deck that is, but it's a link-based deck. Uh, yes, there are synchros as well, but... Uh, most of the people that I uh, was against went the link variation, which is to link away and link away and link all your cybers monsters to bring on that one big guy. I'll show you on the screen right now. That one big guy that basically just says, unaffected by card effects and you can't run over me because my attack is too high. That's basically what that card is. However, Everyone would summon that in the extra monster zone. And because of that, Cyber Dragon has Chimeretic cards. I don't, I don't even know if that's how you uh, pronounce it. But they have cards which must be summoned by sending a Cyber Dragon monster to the graveyard, along with a monster in the extra monster zone or a monster on the field that's machine. So in the in, in my case, the example I'm going to use right now, uh, I was using a card called Chimeretic Mega Fleet Dragon. And its summoning condition is send one cyber dragon to the graveyard and send one um monster in the extra monster zone to the graveyard and then you can special summon this card this is not an effect so even if it's unaffected by card effects it's a summoning condition which means it bypasses all of that so as i'll say i would get players that spend five minutes setting up their board just to bring on that monster and then i would special summon cyber dragon during my turn which is not a card effect because I control no monsters, I can special summon this card. That's the uh, uh, summoning condition of Cyber Dragon. And then I would send Cyber Dragon and their monster that they sent five minutes setting up to the graveyard to summon by Mega Fleet Dragon. Now, when this happens, they scoop and then they find me on PlayStation. I have no idea if you guys have experienced this, but they find me on PlayStation. And when they find me on PlayStation, they send me all of these messages uh, very, very harmful, uh, messages with, uh, intent to annoy me. I don't know, but it wasn't just that it was also harm. I'm not going to mention it in the video because they were, they were very, you know, yeah, I'm not going to mention it on there. Uh, yeah, you can tell that guy was annoyed. It was quite funny actually, but, um, this happened frequently. And when something happen happens frequently, it can get to your head. So... Unfortunately, that's that's what happened. So yeah, uh, next time uh, I would do, I would get the almost the exact same player, not the exact same player, but the exact same deck, and it would happen. And for some weird reason, when I do the exact same thing, funny thing is, all my monsters count as being Cyber Dragon monsters, so it doesn't have to be the original Cyber Dragon. I can normal summon Cyber Dragon Core, search a monster. And whether he negates it or not, if it's not destroyed, it's still a Cyber Dragon on the field. And then I would send Cyber Dragon Core, which is a 400 attack position monster. And his hard, like, time spending monster that he's, he literally summoned, like, the monster in five minutes, setting up all of his cards just to get that monster on the field. And then I would summon Chimeretic Mega Fleet Dragon, he would scoop, and then he would send me a message. It's happened six times in one week. And it's happened for quite a bit of time. Uh, actually, uh, before I started posting the um, the replays of uh, Generators versus uh, Dark Magicians, which you should see uh, on the top right of your screen. So, yeah, I'm taking a break from Master Duel. Uh, I will be going back to Master Duel because I really enjoy it. 
uh, I enjoy the concept of Master Tool. I enjoy um, the um, the the cards. I enjoy the animations. I love the animations, and I also enjoy the fact that the Wind Barrier Statue got banned. So yeah, extremely funny. Fluandry's players are going to get hit on that. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely going to come back when that's when that's over and done with. Uh, maybe even earlier. Uh, as of now, uh, what am I going to be doing instead? I'm going to be doing some uh, Dueling Nexus content. So uh, there's a website called Dueling Nexus. You can operate on your phone or on a PC slash laptop. Uh, and it's like um, the normal way you play Yu-Gi-Oh. So TCG, you can search up whatever card you want and then create your deck. And then you can go into ranked matches with that deck. You can sometimes play the OCG version of certain cards. However, if you do ranked matches, you have to play TCG. I'm currently a diamond player. Uh, in fact, I was uh, a master player in um, in uh, Dawn of Nexus. So yeah, um, I think there's bronze, silver, gold, diamond, platinum, master. Uh, I'm not sure if diamond and platinum is in the right positions, but yeah, I'm a master in um, in Dawn of Nexus. That's not a flex because there are many other masters in that in that um, format and they play the Tillaments and the Sprite. Although Sprite is kind of lame now because there are so many ways to get around it. I mean, Rivalry cuts um, uh, Sprite, but it doesn't cut uh, Tillaments to a certain extent. But yeah, that's it. Uh, I'm going to be show showcasing my Cyber Dragon deck, uh, the TCG version. And I'll let you guys know when I get back onto Master Duel. It'll be very soon. And that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys in the next video.